No, we're doing we're doing upper body and core today anyway, so we'll be all set for big ones in the weekend. Alright. Okay, so if you take your band, so we start that timer now. Just for, I don't think I need it today, but we start it anyway. Alright. Um, so taking arms out in front as per usual. Let's just go for 10 pull aparts. So you're going to do the same thing, just turn the hands out, so you have the palms facing outwards, same movement, pull it apart again. Okay, so put your hands back for me. We're going to do the same movement again. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Alright, so turn it around. So you're going to do the same movement again, just turn the palms the opposite way around. Turn the palm over hand. Morning, how are you? Go for 10. That's it. Okay, so over the shoulder, we do the triceps. Okay, so the first line you're going to pull up. Keep it in the same line. Pull it down. Go for ten again. Ten. All right. So swap it over for me then. Last time. We're going to pull it down. So we can get rid of that. Okay, so we're doing a big set of exercises there for you. So we're going to do a good range of um, motions, bicep curl, overhead press, pull-ups, frontal raise to overhead, reverse curl, pull-up, behind your back and reverse fly. We're going to do each exercise three times before we move on to the next one. So the idea is we start, we start at one weight, we'll, we'll, do, we'll do 10 reps, if you feel you can put on some weight for the next one, you can put on some weight, but we're going to do it three times each one, so, so the idea is that if you think it's a bit light, just throw on more weight if you can, alright? Yeah. 
You can hear me all right, Chad. So the first one is going to be a bicep curl. We're going to do 10 reps. We're going to have a short little break. We're going to put on some more, some more weight if we feel we can. We're going to do 10 more reps again. All right, so when we're ready then, we're going in three, two, one, off you go. We're going for 10. One, two. That's it, control it on the way down as well, nice and slow. Throw on a bit more if you can, or if you want. We're doing it three times, so you can leave it to the next one if you want. Okay, you all ready? Okay, off we go. Ten more again. Enough with that way? Yeah. All right, everyone ready? Okay. Last time. Off we go. Ten reps. Six, seven, eight, that's it, full extension, nine, and ten, drop it down, that's three of the bicep curl, next one we're doing three military press or overhead press, so same again, you can take off the weight, chest, press it overhead, coming back down, very ready, Back to the chest. Two, three. Try not to lean into it with the hips. enough, leave it as it is. Oh, 
Okay, looks like we're all ready. All right, back to the start. Off we go, 10 more. One, nice and controlled. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and down. One more set. Okay, looks like we're all ready. Back to start, up on the chest. Off you go. Go for 10. One, two, three, four, five. Try not to arch the back. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And down. All right. Next one, we're doing pull up. So we're going to start right down on the waist. We're going to pull it up under the chin. Again, we're going to look for full, full extension at the bottom. So we're going to pull it up, let, let it hang all the way down. Right up underneath the chin, arms level. Back down again. I think we're all ready. Okay. Hands just about hip width apart. Center the bar. I'm going to pull it up to here and back down. That's it. Off you go. Two, three, don't forget to breathe, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and down to finish. Everyone happy with that? Everyone change? Yeah. Okay. We're all happy to go. That's it. Three, two, one, off we go. Looks like we're all ready. Last time, hands hip with apart, up underneath the chin. Then we go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, drop it down, well done, next one is a full, a full frontal raise, so try it at a lower weight if you want,
So this is what we're going to do like the frontal raise, only we're going to bring it right overhead. I want to say, I have new clips here as well if you want to get to change them. Oh, Daddy, thanks, Daddy. Okay, I did it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a workout when it's on. Right, so the, the full frontal raise. So you're going to start out down for the dips, up in front, up overhead, back to the front, and back down. Alright, so it's almost two movements. First arm is out, out the shoulders, then up, back to shoulders. And back down, alright? That's it, off you go. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. The target is ten, you don't have to get that. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine, nearly there. And ten. That's it. Drop it down. Should the mini is singing? to get there, it means you have to get there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you don't. Like I said, the target on all these exercises is 10 reps. If the weight is too heavy, don't worry about not doing the 10 reps. If you have to go down the weight, take it off, put on something lighter, that's no problem. Okay, ready to go. This is a tough one. Same thing again. When you're ready then. Three, two, one, off you go. It's that slight pause in the middle is what kills it. Four. Five. Six, seven, nearly there, eight, nine, uh, ten, excellent, well done, one more set. This is the this is the hardest exercise of the lot. This is tough. It is a tough one, yeah. The pause on the way up. Yeah, pause the pause there yeah. to have to go again. That's what. <laughs> yeah. Ready? Yeah. Off we go. Seven, three left. Nine, last one. Ten. Nine, 
That's it. Okay, try and swing out the arms. Give me a couple of seconds. So we've got three exercises left. Three sets in each one. So we have reverse curl, um, reverse curl, pull up behind the back and reverse fly. <laughs> okay, so the reverse curl, knuckles facing out. It's like the curl and press, but we're only going to curl it up underneath the chin and back down. So knuckles facing out. We're going to be just using the elbows. So, three, two, one, off you go. That's it. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eight, seven. Right, just give me a couple of seconds. Everyone ready again? Yep. What's up? There we go. Last time with the curl. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, ten, excellent. Whew. Drop it down. Okay, two more left. And then we'll have a bit of core work on the floor. Two more left. Three sets in each one, so it's 60 lifts all together. Next one is your pull up behind your back. So again, if you want to start low on the weight, you can add it on. We're doing three sets. So if you want to step forward with the bar, step over. We're going to pick it up behind your back. You just demonstrated there. Yep. Yeah. Can you see me here now? Yeah. So bar is behind my back. Right. Just going to pull it up and back okay. down. You're only going to get the bar midway up your back. When you do it, try not to force your head forward. The tendency is that you're going to 
tensor your neck and push your head forward, try and keep it relaxed as you pull the bar up. Alright? Okay. Okay, off we go for 10. Nine and ten. So same as the pull-up we had previous, hands it, hip width apart. So when, when your hands are behind your back on the bar, should almost hands should be almost on your bum. We're gonna go for ten, three, two, one, off we go. Six, seven, eight, keeping the neck relaxed, nine, and ten. One more set. Okay, one more ready then. Three, two, one. Off we go. Three folks end up breathing as well. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's it, dropping it down. Alright, so you're finished with the bar there this morning. Next one is a reverse fly. So you need two individual weights. Same thing if you want to start low. We have three sets, so you can change weights as you're going. Before. So you're going to hinge weights down in front, you're going to hinge over from the hips, and the weights hang down. You're going to press it up behind the shoulders, get the elbows back, weight up level with the shoulders. That's it, we're going for 10. Five. Five. Try to keep the back straight. Here to keep the back straight, you're only hinging over from the hips only, so you shouldn't have your back rounded like that. Slight bend on the knees, hinge from the hips, your back is straight, hands hanging down. We're going in three, two, one, off you go. That's it, guys. One more time, 10 reps. Okay, leaning over from the hips again, arms out in front, three, 
two, one. Off you go. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. And ten. Excellent. That's it, you can get rid of the weights there now. We're going to do some work on the floor for core. So if you want to get a mat. Okay, so we're going to do some planks. First of all, we have a plank touch. Take it on the side plank. Then we've got crunches, side plank again. We're going to do a normal plank and a crunch. Each one is a minute long, give or take. <coughs> Bless you. <laughs> all right. So when we're ready then. So a plank touch, we're going to down on the elbows. We're going to plank, just reach out, touch the floor further ahead. Okay, so we're going to go for a minute. In three, two, one. Down you go, down onto the elbows. Nice straight back, hips down low, reach out, touch the floor in front. You find the hips are wrapping a lot side to side, just put the feet further apart. Try not to twist your body around as you lift the hand to reach in front. Keeping the hips down low. 20 seconds to go. Nearly there. Seven seconds. Three, two, and one. Down. Well done. Next one is a side plank. Down on your elbow. And one foot on top of the other. If balance is a problem, you can put one foot in front of the other, keep both feet on the floor. Okay, we're going in three, two, one, off you go. Lifting up. Hand high in the air if you can, straight line from your hand down through the shoulders to the elbow on the floor. That's it, hips nice and high. And the core nice and solid. Don't forget to breathe it out. Shoulders will be tired after those exercises. Keeping it going. You have to drop down, take a few seconds of a break, you can come back up again. Try to have a straight line from the shoulder to the hip, down to the foot. Three, two, one, and down. Excellent. Give yourselves a break for a couple of seconds. We're going to move into a basic crunch and then we'll do a side plank the opposite side. So basic crunch first. 
Okay? Feet flat on the floor. Hands on the legs as you crunch up. Bring the leg, bring the hands to meet your knees and back down again. So we're going in three, two, one, off you go. Oh, rush it. Just nice and steady all the way through. Twenty seconds to go. Nearly there, ten seconds. Four, three, two, one, and down. Right, side plank, opposite side. Getting ready to go. And we're going for one minute. We're going in three, two, one. Up you go. It's high in the air. That's it, straight line from the shoulder to the hip to the legs, and straight line from the hand through the shoulder into the elbow. If you have to drop it down, that's no problem. Give yourself two or three seconds, five seconds, come back up again. 20 seconds to go. That's it. It'd be better to do 30 or 20 or 30 seconds, really good. Five seconds to go. Ouch. Three, two, one, and down. Excellent. Right, we have crunch, plank, and crunch left. So when you're ready, back into your crunch. Same thing again. Feet flat on the floor, hands on the legs. You're just going to crunch up to bring the hands to the, to the knees. In three, two, one, off you go. Halfway. That's it. Keep the ball nice and steady. In fifteen seconds left. Five. Three. Two. One and down. Oh. You start to feel them towards the end, alright? One more left, two more left, plank and crunch. Okay, so getting ready to go for our plank. Straight plank, no other moves, one minute long, 
three, two, one, off you go. We'll try to keep your palms flat on the floor. Hips down low. <laughs> Morning, Hannah. <laughs> Morning, Hannah. When are you going to start doing that? <laughs> Ready there. 30 seconds done. Don't forget to breathe. Nice big deep breaths. Ten seconds to go. That's it, squeezing that core. Three, two, one, and down. Excellent, well done. One more set of crunches. And one more minute of crunches to go, and that's it. Okay, five seconds. Okay, we're going three, two, one. Up you go, one more minute. Try to keep the neck relaxed, the head. Try to keep the shoulders and the head moving together. Don't pull the neck forward as you come up. Try to pick a point on, on the ceiling. And just keep looking at that. And really there, 20 seconds. Ten seconds. Push it, push it, push it. That's it, keep going. Five. Three, two, one, and down. That's it. Well done, guys. Thanks very much. Thank nice, you, guys. Nice big workout today. Enjoy your weekend. We'll see you on Monday. Thank you. Thank you too. No problem, Bye. Bye. See you then. Bye. Bye.